Hello everyone, so I've been thinking a lot about what can I record, what isn't boring. And I've got a few things, just the issue is I need my friends, and they are not available at the time. So, I'm sitting here playing video games with my friends over Skype, thinking, hmm, what should I do? And I'm asking my friends, saying, what should I do? And so we continue to play this game, just put brainstorming to the back of my head, and then we finish the match, and it hit me. I like to talk about happiness, and I like to make people happy. It's something that I really, really like to do, and I think everybody likes to make people happy. It's just about actually doing it. So it was the match that kind of set off this thought. To start off, what happened in the match is my friend played a position he is not used to and he didn't mean to play. I like to compare it to tests. This might be a bit more intense than the in-game thing, but say you're sitting all week for a chem test, and then you sit down at the test and see it's a physics test. You clicked the wrong button when you were signing up, or you checked the wrong box. This is not good. And also along the lines with the whole test scenario, say then there's me who didn't prepare very much for the test. I was playing a position that I didn't play very often, and also with a person I don't play with very often. So it was two more unknown things for me. And now to add on to it, in a game of five players versus five players, two of our players disconnected, which means three versus five. Think about basketball. You're playing with three team members on one team versus five team members on the other team. It's gonna be very, very, very difficult. But even with all these odds against us, we were playing really well, and we kind of automatically assumed that it was going to be a loss in the beginning, but we did well, and we kept doing well. And then eventually we won, and it was crazy. It was like I just won the lottery or something with my friend. We were both so happy and excited, and it was just the most awesome thing ever. But when you think about it, it's just a game that we're playing, but we're this happy and excited over it. What I'm trying to bring this to is, if you're sad or feeling down or just simply not happy, find something to be happy about, anything. It can be a game you play, it can be a thing you do, just literally anything. Distract yourself, make you happy, and then figure out the situation. What can you do to fix it, or what can you do to get through it? Basically, I was just thinking, no matter what had been going on today, I wasn't sad or feeling down, but if I was sad or feeling down, that little moment would have just, like, blown me away. That would have been so awesome to me, no matter what was on my mind at the time. So do something that takes your brain off things. Just take a break sometimes. Make yourself happy. It'll seriously help you out in the long run. So that's all I wanted to say to you guys this week. Um, I might have to take a break from vlogging or doing videos once school starts back up, because I will be even busier than last year. I will try my best. But I'm just warning you guys, hopefully I'll have more information on that next week. But I hope you guys have had a great week. Please leave a rating, comment, subscribe, and stay happy everyone. Later.